what's up guys, it is Deltray and it is finally time! Yes, that's right, we are going on to Riavana's castle. Real quick before we do, I may as well explain everything that I did, which is not a whole lot. I just bought Auto Potion uh, with my G here, since he earned enough JP from the last few battles in order to get that. Uh, it's going to be pretty huge, not necessarily on this next map, but the one following that, I'm basically going to need some kind of defensive ability. Uh, we also have Regina, and my item setups are a little bit weirder this time because... This next map is really, really weird, and I kind of want to bait the AI into being dumb if I possibly can. I don't know. We're going to figure it out real quick, but Regina has the white robe because it's going to give her enough for a flare too, and it also cuts in half the damage from fire, lightning, and ice attacks, which might be very nice because there's lots of hell knights on this next map, which are basically just souped up ninjas in this case. So, uh, it's going to be, it's going to be something else. I don't know if we're going to be able to do it very easily. We have a stale honored dance setup. This turned out to be super, super good. And since a lot of the enemies on the next map have very low HP, I think that this will help us cut them down really, really quickly. Or at least that's the idea. Then we have the MCP who has absolutely no armor of any kind because he has arrow guard. And I want the enemies to be able to one shot him, basically. So that way they'll be tempted to shoot on him even though he's going to have arrow guard. So he'll have a really good dodge rate even if the archers on this next map have concentrate. Uh, th that's the fear here, right? There's like three archers or so, three or four archers that all have the high ground on you right off the bat. So you need a way to deal with that somehow. And in theory, they should all just go for MCP because they should be able to technically kill him. But they probably won't be able to because of arrow guard. Or at least that's my plan. Oh yeah, and there's also... Yurchel, who's been doing the same thing since forever. I gave him precision just so that he can maybe go for like a time strike or something. I don't know. I might have to switch that to like item or some kind of revival. There's also Rafa, who I made into a chemist with no kind of HP and abandoned. Because it's a similar idea as to what we're doing with uh, MCP. Except if Rafa dies, it actually takes one of the enemies on the next map with her. No time like the present though. Riavana's castle. Let's get it. Now... This is about the point in the regular game where a lot of people just get hardwalled because they save over their only file, not realizing that this is a three-part fight. Four-part, possibly, depending on how you want to count it. But you have to do three fights back-to-back -back with no chance to go for any kind of grinding, item buying, nothing like that. Once you go to Riavana's Castle, that is it, so be very, very well prepared before you do this. Uh, in my case, I have lots of stuff that prevents Petrify, and I have lots of ways to clear Petrify, which would be the main thing. It also helps in 1.3's case to have a way to break enemy stats, kind of like we did with Kecklin way back when. So we have to be able to do that. We need to be able to survive because there's a duel, a one-on-one -on -one duel between my G and a certain character. So having some kind of defensive abilities will really help you as well. I'm probably going to have him as a squire with like auto potion because he can, he can give himself regen, he can give himself haste. And... Uh, Maybe with, like, white magic as a secondary, maybe get protect. I don't know. I guess we'll see about that when we get there. But the idea is that you want some kind of defensive utility. Otherwise, you're probably hosed. Other than that, good DPS helps as usual. Da-da-da-da-da. Not too much crazy about that. But some ability to prevent Petrify, preferably on somebody who can clear Petrify, would be very good. Arrow Guard helps as well in 1.3 because there's lots of archers on this next map. Uh, anything else, really? I, I, I don't know. I don't know. The third fight in this series isn't nearly as bad, I want to say, although it's very RNG and always has been, but I guess we'll get to that when we get to that, right? Blah, welcome. How do you like our castle? I feel like Barrington would also sound like that. It looks a little Spartan compared to Los Alia Castle, but I like it. This castle built for war. It's far more beautiful than one built for government. Even though it's already been ruled by men with power. If war broke, the royal family lost the power. Blah. Get to the point, old man. That's right, I don't have enough of this guy already. Blah, you're being amazing! To be quite frank, can we work together? Now this is Baron Ted, he is the adopted father of both Rafa and Malak. If that, I, I forget if the game said that or not by this point, I think it did. I think Malak was complaining about that the first time we meet Rafa. But if it's not clear, this is the guy they're referring to. What do you mean? But as I said, men with power rule evilly. So who had the power? Prince Lark of Hokusen? Or Prince Koltana of Nantes? Neither of them. It's the Uthrine Knights who hold the stones. Huh. But only stones have great magical power. 
According to the ancient legend, a natural disaster of Muron was gone by its power. <laughs> well, excuse me. I didn't expect a Grand Duke like yourself believed in such fairy tales. So you're saying you don't believe it? That's right. They say the Dracula of Lionel died from problems with a stone. I heard he died of illness. But why are you after the young Bayob? Why take after him as a heretic? We don't question decisions by heresy examiners. Vormive's not buying it. Oh my! You're saying you know nothing about it! But you may tell your mind after saying this! Cobblock! So do you guys understand him, or...? <laughs> oh god damn it, his loot. F father I'm sorry. I see. We have Scorpio and Taurus! Moron! Ow. Excuse me, sir. We verified the intruder's identity. Malak, I'll let you take care of him. I'm so sick of this Malak guy. <laughs> I really am. What do you want? Was he radioactive for a second? As I said before, we want to help you too. And what if I refuse? The church's injustice will be exposed. That's all. You can't prove it with just the holy stones. Exactly. But how about with the Dramatic Scriptures? Blar, Gotana, and the Senate ought to be interested. Where is it? I can't tell you. Weegraf, go after the wizard. I'll take care of here. But I won't do anything funny. The odds are against you. Oh, is that what you think? Odds? What do you think you weak humans can do? Father? Ugh. Don't underestimate us. Killing you is easy. But are you upholding me? I don't know why. It, he just seems like he would be that kind of guy. Want to fight? Fine. I'll show you the power of the Holy Stone. No, don't do it. I'm not ready yet. Don't do it. Uh, he did it. So, once again, if the game ever asks you to save, God, oh God, do not use your only save slot. I absolutely refuse to do so. You'll die. Oh yeah, you will definitely die if you're not ready. I don't even know if I'm ready, to be honest, but we're going to find out real quick. This next fight is, honestly, in my opinion, by this point, the hardest one. I would have said the next fight, but I'm more used to it, I guess. I That's kind of a strange thing to say, but I played it enough times to have a good idea of what you need to do. I'm sure I'll be eating my words, no doubt. But I have some idea of how to tackle the next fight pretty consistently. This one, not so much. I guess we're just gonna have to play it by ear. We gave Rafa some evasion. Okay, for some reason I was getting hella slow down there. Which is definitely a new one for me. I, I can't imagine why this game would be particularly taxing for any reason, but hey, here we are. I think we want to try something a little bit like this. Not sure that this is gonna work out. I really don't know, but let's at least see what we can see. I'm very much considering this a scouting run because honestly, man, honestly, man, all I know is I want to spread out quite a bit because all of these guys have AoEs that are instant cast and they can probably drop just about anybody, potentially, if luck is on their side. So we don't really want to allow them to do that too freely. Malak, please stop. Let's go together. Let's not. You know what happens to traitors. You'll be chased by your ex-allies and killed. Even if you escape, you'll live your life frightened. I'd never want to live like that. But Grand Duke promised to free us after this job. Do you believe him? You know he's lying. If we don't escape now, we'll be his slaves for life. I trust him. We'll be free if we kill him and take the Germanic scriptures. So we still have the scriptures? I thought we... I guess not. Do we have them all game long? No, 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 never, never mind, never mind. Ignore me, ignore me. But what we can't ignore is that large number of archers on top of the wall. There's two of them on the right-hand side and one more on the left. They will all be able to shoot us from basically anywhere on the map because, quite frankly, they just have a billion and a half range at this point. Bullshit. Bullshit. I'm going to die, am I? I'm going to die, man. I'm going to die. I'm so going to die. Little John, what? <laughs> yeah! 
Oh, no, please, come on. That's half damage? Oh, no, 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 that's the magic shuriken. Okay, so he threw something different. I thought he was throwing a ball. They usually do. But of course he wouldn't throw one, obviously, because we would cut the damage in half. So this girl only has an 18% chance to hit. She doesn't, thankfully. It's better if Rafa stays alive for a little bit because that's going to distract these guys. Of course, some of them may have concentrate as they do. <sighs> it would have been nice if Malak didn't get the 20% chance. What you're saying is right. No use escaping. Let bygones be bygones. How come she can't do that when I control her? Wait, Rafa, what are you doing? Him too. Neither of them have teleport. That's bullshit. Grade A BS. What I do know though is I'm gonna heal back. Oh Regina, and we're gonna we're gonna stall basically. We're, we're gonna stall. 100%. Because I genuinely believe that Estelle can kill most of these guys by herself. Look at that, nine rounds. We just have to get nine rounds. Why? Why does he do eight million? And no auto potion, so we're gonna die probably. Just a very unfortunate luck, no less. I believe that, yeah, flails cannot miss. So despite my G having good evasion, it doesn't matter. Yeah, I'm just gonna call this an L right now. That was just unlucky, sadly. Although, maybe I can give Rafa a little bit more HP so that she can at least take one shot and then just leave MCP to be the one who draws all the archers. Maybe, maybe. Okay, this time Rafa does have more HP. She has more than MCP, but less than everybody else. So, in theory, she should be the target of choice. Now, Malak is, of course, going to come over here and try to get lucky again, I have no doubt. And he probably will, because just screw me, I guess. 20% chance to actually be hit by any of these. Stop. 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 He will never be this good when I use it. Okay. Okay. Well, if they go for Rafa... Then that's that, though. That would be just as good, really. But I just need to not get 20%ed, basically. Of course, he can roll it any number of times, up to 10 times, basically. What? Oh, I didn't give her the damn. <sighs> I'm an idiot. But oh well. Yeah, that's what I get for loading a save state and not loading my save, I guess. But this should be pretty decent. Oh, they're actually going to go for this much smarter move. I guess. I don't know how the AI works, really. It just does whatever it feels like, truthfully. But I'm going to need to pick him up. They should have went for Rafa, though. They just they just hate me, I guess. Fortunately, I'm not going to lose any time with him because I can just hit him with a fairy before his next move, I think. Pretty sure that that's how this works. And if I move you to the corner, we should be okay. Actually, Rafa might have just done it. Oh, good. She's going to get MCP back. Good. That's what we want to see. Okay, we might actually be in this. Thanks to the AI being good, believe it or not. <laughs> now, if I have any luck, she's just going to try to kill MCP and fail. Yeah. 28%. Good. Now, the ninja will probably be able to kill him, of course, but that's okay. That's fine by me. Basically, we're just trying to stall, like I say. Not the most glamorous of wins, but I... Like, what's the alternative here, <laughs> really? What's the alternative? Uh, what is that now? Where's Alma? I'm not healing. I can see you're worried about her. Just hand me the Germanic scriptures and I'll save you. Can we just give him the scriptures? I really don't want to play this map. My G, don't believe him. He's lying. Baron Tin will kill both of you once he gets what he wants. Whatever you do, don't give him the scriptures. Your sister will be safe, only as long as you have the book. I mean, she's not wrong. So we missed your turn. We won't miss your turn. I might actually be able to just bop that guy. Like, no lie. How, what, what's your compatibility? Ah, uh, not, not looking too favorable. There's also really good stuff you can steal on this map, by the way. Uh, namely, the spell edges. There's some angel rings, which lets you start the battle with re-rays. The best bow in the game. Well, one of the best bows. The ultimate bow gives you a point of speed. You can steal all of that crap, but I don't care. Tonbury's nice, flash hats. Yeah, this is about the point where the creator just said, screw it, let's give the enemies every advantage possible. Every single one. But hey, that's not gonna stop us. Forever, anyways. It's gonna stop us right now, most likely. I wish they would just go for Rafa. Like, no lie, I don't know why they won't. 
I, I mean, she has evasion on her side, so that's probably a huge part of it. There we go. That's what I was thinking would happen. <laughs> I wish they would go for Rafa, though. That would help out a ton. But it is good information to know that we can just one-shot that Hell Knight if he decides to charge anything at all. You didn't think the Whale Whisker suddenly stopped being broken or something, I hope. <laughs> no, definitely not. Either way, I could have just went for this, which would have went off before the Comet spell. Like, if he had survived on a little bit of HP or whatever, that would have been a viable move. And I also have Elemental if for some reason I absolutely needed to kill that guy. So he wasn't really too much of a danger. If anything, we want to throw something at this guy right here, because that is going to let us knock him out with the Whale Whisker as well. Theoretically. Does he have, like, defense up or something that's doing a little bit lower than I would have thought? I can't really check. I, I assume he has, like, defense up or something. One other nice thing about Wiznibus, I guess, is that it doesn't care about defense up at all. It just does a fixed amount of damage no matter what, so that's pretty cool. And since none of these guys have health, really, like, not a spectacular amount, if this goes off about ten times, we automatically win. Just by default, because they don't have a whole lot of health. Goodbye, my friend. Yeah, Malak is stupidly fast. So I'm really hoping they try to kill Rafa. Because if they do, Malak just leads, as we saw. They're going to kill Regina, I have no doubt. Oh, oh, wow. Oh, I've made a huge mistake. I've made a huge mistake. I should have moved. I should have definitely moved. Thing is, though, I'm not really, like, 100% on a lot of stuff here. Namely exactly how much bonus range they get from being on certain heights and whatnot so it's, it's kind of hard to calculate that unless you're like a master of this game i know this game pretty well but i don't know random crap like that you know what i mean so i, I guess that's something to consider she can just run down here and shoot me i do feel like they went too far with this map though i'm not gonna lie because the only real thing you could do is like have a team full of Arrow guard? Yeah, I've definitely lost now. There's no possible way. I mean, I guess you could have a team full of arrow guard, but if you if you require grinding in your game, it's bad design by default. There's no alternative. It's just it's always bad design. Okay, Rob. <laughs> That's her one use, by the way. Move find item. Well, maybe we can res chain. Well, probably not though. We lost our dancer. Yeah, redo. Actually, I just realized that I can give MCP the Mithril Vest because he still won't have more HP than Rafa, but he will be able to take one stray arrow if he needs to. And it also means that that first ninja can't kill him, basically. Or so goes my theory. Alright, third time is the charm for sure. Let's get it. Oh, I hate this fight. I really do. I really, really do. Don't you do it, Malak. Dismiss. Stop. Stop attacking. Stop attacking. Well, at least we can survive this time, although the ninja can kill me now. I never have anything even remotely resembling that amount of luck whenever I use the lock, so... Kind of bullshit in my opinion? I don't know. I don't know, man. Ideally, we should be able to find at least one spot where the archers can't immediately kill Yurchel, though. Which is what I'm going for. I don't know where that spot is just yet. Yeah, look at this. I had the white robe on and everything. Still takes full damage. Unless that guy has best possible compatibility or something. I don't know. I didn't really check him like that, but... Yeah, gonna probably kill Regina. I... I don't know, man. I really don't know. Because how else would you survive this other than to, like... Evade, stack, and be lucky, I guess? I... I don't know. I really don't. Hopefully Rafa picks Regina back up, though. That would certainly be the best possible outcome. Oh, she missed her turn regardless. <sighs> but I still want her alive as a target, so it's whatever, I suppose. All she was really going to do was heal herself. So it's not like I really lost a whole lot there. Attack Rock. Oh, she, he, she has Concentrate, so never mind. Well, Malak is gone at least. Which is more important, honestly. So goodbye. Probably. Yeah. Barely, barely. 
If we didn't get unlucky right off the bat, this would be a lot better, honestly. If you're wondering why I have him with low HP, it's because the archers literally will never attack him if he doesn't. Worst compatibility? Nope, I lose. Yeah, this is probably the worst design fight in the entire game in my opinion. No, no, I haven't lost a whole bunch of times off screen or anything. I just, it's really, really apparent as to why. Because that, like what was I supposed to do other than not get hit twice? On a 20, it's effectively 20%. It's effectively a 20% chance for him to hit me at all. And it can be anywhere from one to 10 times. And every single enemy on the map can do this. So RNG is an inherent part of this fight. Skill is definitely taking a back seat with this one, no matter what you do. The alternative is to grind up everybody to have arrow guard. It's really, really boring. Why would that be a requirement in something well designed? And I guess you can make the argument, oh, you should have seen this fight coming from the beginning. Which, I mean, to be fair, I obviously know it's here. But that's just such an asinine requirement to waste all that JP for just one fight. I don't know. Because otherwise these guys are just way too strong. You're not tanking them either, believe me. You're, you're just not. And even if you could, it wouldn't matter because, again, they can just kill you with, uh... Their heaven... Or their... Not heaven, but their hell skill or whatever. And the white robe doesn't even do what it's supposed to do, clearly. Otherwise, there's no way that would be doing nearly that much damage. So yeah, a lot of problems with this fight. A lot of problems with this fight. Namely, that it's just bad design. It really is. HP restore at least. There we go. So that's good. Now Rafa should pick up Regina or pick up MCP actually. Good, yeah, he hasn't missed his turn yet, whereas Regina has. If anything though, I should probably change it so that Regina does not outspeed Rafa, which is an easy change to make. I'm not giving Rafa the damn, uh, the thing, whatever it's called, the thief hat, because she'll take it with her. She'll just straight up take it with her. And also, Arrow Guard isn't even a foolproof thing anyways, because they still have about a 1 in 4 to hit you anyways. Now, why would he go for this? Unless he's for sure gonna get it. Okay, cool. I deserve that. I deserve that. But there was no reason that he didn't just kill me. So, you see what I'm saying? There was... I, I don't know, man. I really don't know. Theoretically, he should have just killed me, because he could have. Now, my G... We already know that a neutral hit on this guy will kill him. So as long as we're neutral, I think I must have had good compatibility with him or something last time because if I've done my math right, he should not die. So I'm actually going to wave fist him. Oh, we got a crit actually. Huh. How about that? Yeah, but my G can just... I mean, I'd love to do that, but I know it won't work. Uh, right here though, it, it doesn't matter where I stand. I'm going to be in range to be knocked over by a dang. So it does kill. It would have killed. What am I doing wrong then, I wonder? I must be forgetting something, clearly. Right, cause 16 times 12. Yeah, I don't know why that kills, but it does and we'll take that. We definitely take those. Not witch on with Snipus, get to the corner with ya. To the corner with ya. And I'm actually gonna throw on this guy. I think that would be the way. Yep, there's a good chance this goes through. It does, cool. So now my G can drop him, breaking his re-raise. But I believe that that guy had item, right? So... He does have Elixir at this point. Which is annoying, <laughs> because they can just spam those indefinitely. I guess we'll see. It is nice that Rafa has abandoned, though. That's gonna help us out a little bit. But, I don't know if that's really better, because that means Malak is still here. It would probably be for the best if he would just leave. Of course. Of course, I have such awful luck with that. I kid you not, guys, when you, you do eventually get to use these abilities for yourself, and it's never like that. It's never like that. You will never hit your target. I promise, never in a million years. Especially Rafa. Oh my god, Rafa is awful. Let's get this auto potion though. Keep us in it. I mean, she kind of has to. Otherwise, she's gonna die. She does, thankfully. 
And we, we definitely need her up, though. She's going to be doing so much damage. There's two. If she can survive, like, six more rounds, we win. Basically. But it's going to be tight. I can tell you that. I do think they should, like, almost certainly kill Rafa at this point, though. And that's what we want to see. That's exactly what we want to see. Now, of course, if I get nailed with something bad like that, we're going to lose. <sighs> yeah, I for sure lose again. I have no more revival. Okay, so I beefed up my team a little bit in terms of HP. I Since all I'm really trying to do is survive, I guess that works. Because I, I really am. I'm going to let Estelle do basically everything. Because I'm so sure that she can. But even then, really, it just doesn't matter. Because they can technically kill anybody at all times. And they shouldn't. Like, it, it shouldn't happen. Certainly not as frequently as it has been. Like, see there. Whenever I use Malak, that's more like it, to be honest. <laughs> that's more like what I'm used to. Uh, I did beep up Regina to the point that she should, in theory, be getting three hit KO'd by these guys and not two hit KO'd. Yeah, she is. Cool. Now, of course, if they just shoot her, that's probably bad. But since the white robe doesn't do anything to these guys anyways like it's supposed to, it doesn't really it doesn't really change anything. Uh, she is slower than Rafa this time, so Rafa should be reviving her, if anything. And since MCP did not get uh, unfortunately hit by that initial attack, he should be good here as well. I also question whether or not they can even really do much of anything to my G. Really? <sighs> uh, what, what was I supposed to do? <laughs> I, I, I mean, he has arrow guards, so... Yeah, they didn't think this through. Like, at all. It's painfully apparent. But they should at least try to waste another attack on this. If it hits, I'm resetting. Yeah. I mean, I'm pretty confident this is a setup, but... There's only so much you can do. There's only so much you can do, because this map is just not designed for consistency at all. It's kind of the problem with these RNG-esque abilities. So the best thing you can do is try to, like, minimize the risk of bad luck. But with the randomness as high as it is, I mean, what is minimizing the risk here? We're talking, like, coin flips, basically. Because, again, any enemy on this map... Well, not any enemy. All the Hell Knights can theoretically kill you at any point, regardless of anything. Hey, sweet. Of course, that, that's an extreme scenario, but... I mean, we've seen that the game doesn't really care about any of that. Or Arrow Guard, for that matter. God, twice in a row. Twice in a row. Please just heal your children. Oh, I also gave Rafa a gun, because she actually has very good evasion with Abandon and whatnot, so... Until they actually decide to kill her, which they should be able to do right here. But until they actually do it... Oh, they're actually going to kill Yurchul. Cool. Well, I say cool, but I should be able to save his turn, which is all that I really care about. Uh, but basically, in the meantime, until she eventually dies, she can at least do some damage. Which is what I'm looking for. And since MCP did not get his turn wasted this time, we're not looking so bad. Depending on what this ninja does. Which it looks like he's going to take a shot at Rafa. Oh, how unfortunate. I can't actually get into range of that guy no matter what. To take him out with anything, really. Uh, well. I say we get Yershul back. Seems to make sense to me. Something else kind of annoying is that all of these guys have really low faith. But, it, I mean, it makes sense. It makes perfect sense because uh, they need that to do their damage, basically. The untruth abilities work on reverse faith. So the lower faith you have, the more damage it deals to you. Yep, we got, we got to get damage on that guy. For sure. And I also don't want to be next to MCP because I will die. Hey, I actually will get a flare, huh? Yeah, we're going for it just because I I need as much damage as possible. 133, 84, not really great, but it also 
It's gonna speed things up very significantly, basically. So we go like that. I can probably kill this guy, honestly. This guy right here, I mean. So I think we go for that. If I hit him with this, he will... Damn it. He won't die to crap. But he'll probably... No, I don't want to do that, actually. I just goofed. I can't... I can't go for the, the thing on him because he'll just heal himself. Actually, his CT is really low. Do we get two of these before uh, this guy coming up? Is that Greg? It is Greg. So I can. I can throw on him then. And I will. Because he will die before he has a chance to heal himself. Which is the big thing here. Just trying to break his re-raise. This might not even hit Rob, honestly. It's literally a coin flip. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Uh, hopefully she doesn't waste her time shooting the guy who's almost dead. Uh, hopefully with Snipe, just does it all by itself. I wasn't watching too closely as to what the turn order was. And not, I wasn't watching Rafa at any rate. So those ninjas are taking about 100. It seems like sometimes they spawn with way more HP, which is really obnoxious. I feel like it should be more set in stone than that. But anyways, the one is half dead. He's in range of almost anything of my choice. Malak will probably go for MCP as well as... God damn it, he has the power source too. Get this man out of here! If nothing else, they could have done so much worse to me right there. They could have done so much worse. At least he didn't attack me. Now, if this kills somebody, that's really my own fault. I mean, sort of. It's sort of my own fault. Jesus Christ, RNG. Well, at least Rava should probably revive Yurchel, I think, before anything crazy can happen here. And I would imagine she gets her turn before he does, but maybe not. I guess we're just gonna have to see. So she doesn't seem to want to die. Uh, we could be looking okay. Like I say, we're basically just stalling. That's the main goal here. That's a lot of damage. That's <laughs> so much damage. Well, one archer's almost dead. Was the two time strikes really necessary? You better revive your children. What are you doing? Oh, oh, that might be better. That's way better. Yeah. Okay, Rafa, I see you. I'm down for that. I'm down for that. That was really good, actually. <laughs> That's gonna save my ass, huh? And there's this girl who's like, like, what? What are you supposed to do? Oh, Berserk? That's actually really good for me. Unless my G gets Amido. In which case, that's awful for me. Hey, sweet. So unless Greg here kills... Oh, he will, won't he? Damn, dude. Well, I might get a fairy, if nothing else. Miss Regina. Miss Regina. Like, look at that. Every time. It's like heat-seeking. <laughs> what is that bullshit? Every single time. I can't believe the luck of these guys. I can't believe somebody sat down and thought that this was a good design fight. Like, I can't believe somebody thought that this was well designed. That's actually what's more shocking about all of this. Just let MCP move. Just let him move. Come on! <laughs> well, at least there's that. Dodge. Nope. No luck. Never lucky. Uh, let's just see what happens, I guess. Uh, I don't know. Rafa might actually keep me in this. No lie. Depending on how smart she is. I know I don't really like to be relying on Rafa, but... Watch him hit me every single time. Watch him hit me. Watch him kill me with this crap. I can feel it coming. Look at that! <laughs> at least we auto potion that one away, but come on! It's not nearly that good of a move, I assure you. 
Maybe now they try to hit Rafa though, and she has abandoned, so like... Oh, that doesn't matter, not when you have Concentrate, so we're, we're, we're gonna die. We're gonna die, because I have no more Revival. Jesus Christ! So as you can see, uh, beatable, but you just need luck right off the bat. Like, there's not really... I don't see the alternative there. I mean, I guess if you had a hyper-specialized team, like if you planned your entire game around this one moment, I guess, but good luck doing that without grinding your ass off. So, uh, yeah, this is... this is bad. <laughs> this is a bad fight. It just is. Not good at all, but we're done. Unless Irigil kills me, please, please, please don't kill me. Why did I even say it? Why did I even say it? Yeah, attack her. What is that? Temporal strike? No, what are you doing, you fool? At the very least, we can just restore him and then we're done, I think. I want to say, I really hope. Can I spirit surger or? Yeah, I can, okay. So there, we're done. I hate this fight. <laughs> Never return here. Really badly designed. It really doesn't feel as though... It, it doesn't feel like they put too much thought into how this actually plays out. I, I think that they just wanted to have Hell Knights for flavor. If these were ninjas, this wouldn't be half as bad because they couldn't just instantly kill you half the time. Or, or they couldn't like ruin your setup entirely just by RNG. <sighs> bad fight though, bad fight. Probably the worst one until the end of the game though, so there's always that. Help, my monster! God damn, I'm so tired of these Lukabi. I really am. Rava, Alma, please be safe. But I'm gonna blue ball you guys, so next time! <laughs> what, you thought I was gonna go ahead and do another one after that? No, 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 that's enough tactics for me today, thanks. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna get these rewards though. In Ultimus mode, is the best bow in the game. Uh, besides one that you can poach, I think, might be a little bit better. But it's the best standard bow, at any rate. But, we're not gonna go on to the next fight, because it's gonna be very long. It's gonna be its own video, I assure you. Oh, there's story, never mind. Brother. I just realized that the little text boxes change depending on whether or not they're saying it or thinking it. Did you see that? Yeah, it was actually a thought bubble there. 20 years of playing this crap, and I never noticed that. Crazy. Gotta admire the attention to detail, if nothing else. Ooh, that map has me salty. <laughs> I'm still raging. Because I didn't do anything differently, it just it just worked out like it was supposed to, finally. On the other hand, I can't really I can't really fault the game for me having bad luck. That really is more of a personal problem, but oh man. What an awful wound. It still shouldn't be designed like that. Ugh, help. That monster. Come on. Run, it's dangerous. 
Bleh. Yeah, I'm trying to think any way that that previous map makes sense. It, it just doesn't. It's bad design. It's really bad design. I hate to be negative, but I mean, I'm not going to lie to you and say, Oh yeah, I loved that. I loved not having any control over my win or loss. Yeah, nobody ever said that, so... You know. But, that said, we are going to move on to the next fight next time on Final Fantasy Tactics 1.3. Thank you all for watching. Hope that y'all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like rating, and I will catch you guys next time. See ya, peace.